It is all known that the lithography machine plays a vital part in semiconductor fabrication. The lithography machine is renowned in the industry as the crown pearl of semiconductor fabrication with the fast development and ascent of China's science and technology. It can be argued that China's science and technology are prospering and its place in world society has substantially improved the emergence of Chinese technology. On the other hand has become a thorn in the flesh of others. As a result, the U.S. enacted a number of restrictive restrictions at first placed a chip boycott on China, before blacklisting major Chinese technological firms Huawei in particular, was subjected to four waves of repression by the U.S. The most significant point is that the U.S. attempted to block the Netherlands from supplying lithography gear to China. The founder of TSMC Zhang Zhoma once stated that without TSMC's foundry mainland China would be unable to build a piece of high-end chips without the combined efforts of the entire country even if the lithography machine plans were handed to China the Dutch president previously stated that the Chinese would be unable to develop top-level lithography machines all about the lithography machine as the U.S. limits shipments to the Netherlands and the indigenous SME lithography machine makes its premier to that end bid President Wang Chuanfu stated authoritatively chips are man-made not God-made the Dutch Esmal firm must admit that it is a key player in the field of lithography machines, even TSMC and Samsung finished their chip fabrication by acquiring Esmal's lithography equipment the United States improves its export policy and forbids the sale of ESMAL lithography machines to China to avoid the rise of Chinese technology Lao Mei has tried many tactics worked hard and deployed numerous Chinese chip containment measures according to a story in the Wall Street Journal the U.S. exerted pressure on the Netherlands once more using national security as a pretext to prohibit the Dutch lithography machine firm ESMAL from selling sophisticated lithography equipment to Chinese technology businesses as a result the Chinese Ministry of Foreign Affairs spokeswoman emphasized that any containment and repression by the United States will only enhance China's desire and will to develop independently in fact they have a negative attitude against us Chinese if science and technology flourish the country will prosper if science and technology thrive the country will thrive in reality we have already begun to reinvigorate the country via science and technology. To put it frankly we Chinese can achieve anything science and technology will propel China forward nothing can be said about us Chinese our power speaks for itself, we have not slowed down in the face of chip fabrication stuck neck technology, and we are even catching up with ESMAL we have recently made breakthrough development and achieved outstanding outcomes in the semiconductor industry. SMIC made the 14 nanometers to 7 nanometers jump in less than three years under the direction of Liang Mang. Song and accomplished home mature technology mass manufacturing it's all about the lithography machine, as the U.S. limits shipments to the Netherlands, and the indigenous SME lithography machine makes its premiere, there is no diamond no porcelain work as the phrase goes bid presently offers a wide range of products including ICT power devices, SICK devices, IMS, MCUs, CMOS, image sensors, electromagnetic sensors, LED light sources and displays in the realm of semiconductor auto components bid is completely self-sufficient and the sphere of chip design Huawei high silicon can currently compete with Qualcomm according to related reports Huawei's self-developed OLED screen driver chip has finished trial production and is scheduled to formally complete mass production and delivery to suppliers by the end of this year, and it will be used in Huawei's products not only that but the Chinese Academy of Sciences Shanghai Institute of Optics and Mechanics said that it has successfully created optical proximity correction technology a revolutionary technique that can replace traditional optical exposure this technique may better optimize the light source and increase the resolution of lithography the SME package lithography machine is the next piece of good news the indigenous SME lithography machine was introduced Shanghai microelectronics SME is China's sole manufacturer of lithography machines it is also a firm with big hopes in the Chinese market for lithography machines the firm which was founded in 2002 is primarily focused on the research 
and development manufacture sales and servicing of large-scale industrial production projection lithography equipment the company's products are extensively applicable in the fields of IC manufacture and advanced packaging MEMS TSV 3D TOLID and other manufacturing although Shanghai Microelectronics can only manufacture 90 nanometers lithography equipment, it is our own, so there is no need to seek assistance. The business also intends to produce the first domestic 28 nanometers lithography equipment in 2021 according to reports according to media sources the first domestically built equipment SME packaging lithography machine was formally moved in on July 20. At China's Qingdao New Core Technology Company Limited Semiconductor High-End Packaging and Testing Project The project will be completed by the end of this year according to the project introduction the plant has relocated 46 machines and equipment producing 360,000 wafers each year according to reports the world's top high-end packaging technology will be utilized to progressively alleviate the existing scarcity of 5G communication artificial intelligence and other application chips as well. As China's current shortfall of high-tech chips a representative of SMES optical system provider Chang Chunup. Optitech Company Limited previously said link in Chinese, that the business did not engage in the current lithography machine development project another supplier Beijing Guang Optics Company Limited stated in a public job posting link in Chinese that it expects to complete its foundry building by September 2023 the optical equipment for ARF immersion lithography will be mass produced at this new site SME may not complete a new ARF immersion stepper this year Due to challenges with its primary suppliers in this market Beijing RS Laser Optoelectronics Technology Company Limited RS Laser SMES Major Light Source System Provider has produced the first domestic 40W for kilohertz R Flight Source Twinskin NXT 1980D and ESMOL designed equipment now used to produce 28 nanometers chips uses a 60W 6 kilohertz ARF Laser Now Reslacers Team must make a significant technological jump so that SME can complete entire machine on time in the last few years SME. Suppliers have also made some significant advances Tsinghua University's IC equipment team and Uprecision created a dual wafer stage technology in 2016 that could produce parallel reticle stages as small as 2 nanometers. It has become the second business in the world to assume the lead in fundamental technologies in dual-stage lithography breaking up as most technological monopoly according to your recent Precision's IPO prospectus the business plans to create DWC series dual workpiece stages that can be fitted into immersion 28 nanometers lithography equipment in 2021. Fodder resist availability used to be one of the most serious issues with China relying largely on imports particularly for the kind used in lithography equipment Zhang Sunata Optoelectronic Material Company Limited has begun to change the situation by developing a 25-ton R photo resist. Manufacturing line chairman Jian Song Fong announced during the latest online performance report meeting on May 11 that the firm's photoresist has been successfully deployed in an asthmal immersion lithography equipment hinting to a product quality enhancement to summarize China possesses many knowledge and strengths as an ancient culture with a 5,000-year history based on China's for great inventions two bombs and one satellite aerospace manned spacecraft space station and numerous other scientific and technical achievements, there is nothing that we Chinese cannot do. Thank you for taking the time to view today's video. Please leave your comments or recommendations below and let us know what you think about the introduction of China's first homegrown SME lithography equipment this manner, we can show the world China's strength and ambition in lithography and chip manufacturing thanks for having your watching in this video you can add your ideas or suggestions below please keep following our channel and like our videos